Roll along at a slow speed before pulling the front brake and shifting your weight forwards. You'll feel the back wheel come off the ground. At that point, find the balance point above the front wheel and hold before placing the wheel back on the ground. If you feel like you're going to go over the bars, release the front brake and that'll drop the back end down. A great place to learn this is on a slight gradient of a hill as it will make shifting your body weight forwards even easier. You've mastered endos then. Congratulations, well done. But we're going to take it to the next level now and it's time to master the 180 endo turn. Here is exactly how you do it. Roll into the endo, but drop your shoulder to one side as you pull the brake and swing your feet and hips around. Keep your weight forwards as the bike swings around. You'll probably only make it 90 degrees or so to begin with, but keep at it and you'll soon get the whole 180. When you're learning this, you're probably gonna find it easiest to spin the opposite side of what your lead foot is. So if your right foot forwards, you'll spin anti-clockwise. You'll do this because your left foot, your trailing foot, will help kick the back end around. 